YouTube, what is good, man? This your boy Duffy. I know the vibes, man. We are back with another video. Before we jump into this video, man, I'm gonna need y'all to stop what y'all are doing right now and make sure y'all smash that like button. Today, man, let's aim for let's aim for 25 likes on this video. And if um if you're new here, man, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Let me give y'all a little second, man. All right, y'all hit it. All right, say this. I appreciate y'all boys, man. But if you don't know, we are currently sitting at 1,864 subscribers. So at 2,000 subscribers, man, there will be a giveaway on the channel. So make sure y'all have y'all notice on for that. Make sure y'all sub up if y'all new, man. And don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section, man, so I can reply to all y'all boys' comments, any particular bills, videos, any of that good stuff, jump shots, all that, bro. Leave it in the comments, and I reply to all y'all boys' comments. But let's jump straight into the video. Yo, if you're hearing this, man, you're not caught lagging, man. Make sure y'all hit that like button and hit that subscribe button. All right, today, man, I'm bringing y'all a speed boosting paint beast, man. This paint beast does everything. It breaks ankles, makes people fall on the ground looking crazy. It dunks on people. It shoots. It plays defense, man. It's an all-around. It's a it's an all-around valid build, bro. Like this build does everything, but it's it's really unseen of because. It's a the name of it is Paint Beast, and, but like it does everything. So like people are gonna think you can't shoot. People are gonna think like well, this is a Paint Beast, bro. Don't even worry about it. But <laughs> they gonna see, bro. All right, so right now, man, for the position, man, you wanna rock with the power forward position, whatever hand you want. And I got a defensive tackle number, but you know I'm rocking with the one piece. All right now for the skill breakdown, man, you wanna rock with playmaking and defensive. The red and the yellow pie chart. Alright, now for the physical profile, man, you want to make sure you rock with the one that has 78 speed, 87 strength, 72 acceleration, and 54 vert. Alright, now right here, man, y'all already know the vibes on this one, man. Y'all can slow the video down, pause the video, skip through whatever you need to do, man. Or you can go along with me. Just make sure you copy exactly what I have here. If you're a close shot, you want to max it out at 85, max your driving layup, max your dunk, and bring your standing dunk up to a 36. And that'll leave you with six finishing badges. Your mid range, you want to max your mid, max your three, max your free throw, and max your post fade. And that'll leave you with 10 of them green things. For the playmaking man, them gold things, them yellow things, orange things, whatever you want to call it, Max your pass accuracy, max your ball handle, and they'll leave you with 10 of them things. For the, uh, the defensive badges, man, your interior defense, you want to max out. You don't want to touch perimeter. I know it sounds crazy, but, you know, you're a power forward on this build, bro. You're going to be 6'7", 255. You're going to be guarding centers, bro. So it's okay not to touch the perimeter, bro, because you're going to be guarding centers. Your lateral quickness, you want to max out. Don't touch the steal. Your block, you want to bring up to an 84, and then you want to put the rest on your offense rebound and defensive rebound. And that'll leave you with 18 of them red things. For the body shape, man, you know, you know, you know, man. Make sure you rocking with that Burley, bro. If you ain't rocking with that Burr Burr, man, what is you doing? Burley, bro, listen. I used to rock with Slight on all my builds because, you know, I just, I, mean, I just like the skinny look. But, like, when I switched to Burley, bro, I got way more bump animations in the game. I got way more dunks. Like, I don't I don't know, bro. It's something about Burley, bro. Maybe it's just me, but other people have said they have had more bump animations, dunks, and all that good stuff when they chose the Burley body type. So, make sure you rock with the Burley, man. For the height on this build, you want to rock with 6'7". Six, 6'7 seven. Six, seven is the perfect height for this build, bro. For the weight, you want to max it all the way out at 255. For the wingspan, you want to go with the 80. 80 on the dot, man. And let's look at this build at a 99.9 perspective, bro. Off rip, you're getting all the layer packages. Your dunk, man, a dunk at 99.9 is going to jump up to an 87. 
So you're gonna have contact dunks, bro. Your mid range will jump up to a 79. That three point shot, it starts off at a 67, bro. But trust me, with 10 shooting badges plus your high zones, bro, as long as you got them badges and high zones, bro, you're gonna be green even with a 67 three from everywhere. Limitless, all that good stuff. But your three's gonna jump up to a 72. Your ball handling, all you need in this game is a 70 or above ball handle to dribble in this game. So 77 is perfect starting out. And but your um, ball handling at 99.9 will jump up to an 82. Your interior defense is gonna jump up to an 83. Your perimeter, I know you don't really need it on this build because you're gonna be guarding centers, but it's gonna jump up to a 59. Your lateral quickness, your 6'7, 255, but that lateral thing gonna jump up to a 77. That's crazy. You're still, if you got pickpocket on, bro, trust me, you still get still animations and you will still get the steals. <laughs> like, I don't know how to put it, but uh, it's gonna jump up to a 51. Your block is gonna jump up to an 80. The offensive rebound is gonna jump up to an 87. And then your defensive rebound is gonna jump up to a 94. But that's not even the best part about this build, bro. The best thing about this build, bro, is that you're 6'7, 255. Your speed is gonna jump up to a 93. Your gym rat badge and 99.9, .9, your speed is gonna jump up to a 93. Your acceleration is going to jump up to an 84. And if you didn't know, we have Hall of Fame playmaking. So whenever you're, if your acceleration and speed is kind of low, but your player is really big, that quick first step helps out way more because you're bigger and you're like the, the physical attributes on this build are slower. So like you're going to get a like, I don't know if you can say bigger speed boost, but like you're going to notice how fast your player is. Your strength is going to jump up to a 99. So you're not going to get babied in that paint. Your vertical, it's yeah, it's kind of low angle, I see, but it's gonna jump up to a 68. And for the playmaking takeovers on this build, bro, you get playmaking take, glass take, rim protector take, and slashing take. Now, I recommend going playmaking take only because your acceleration will be at 84. You know, it'll make it go up 10, so 94. Your speed will be at 99 and takeover with playmaking take. So I would definitely recommend and prefer playmaking take. I do not recommend glass take because you are kind of short and your arms are not the longest. Rim take is a nice take. It's basically locked down, so that is a good take. Slash and take is also another good take because you do get contact dunks. But you know me, man. If I don't have 99 speed, 99 acceleration off rip, I'm always rocking with the playmaking take, bro. So I'm going to rock with the playmaking take for this build. And there y'all boys have it, man. A speed boosting paint beast, bro. Like, this paint beast ISO build is crazy, yo. Like, sheesh. All right, let's get this boy up to a 99, a.k.a. a 95 overall. I do not know why 2K does that, but this is really your stats at 95 overall. Alright, finish it, man. We got six of them things, bro. That's perfect. It's enough. It's enough. I'm trying to tell you. It's enough. You can either rock with it like this. Contact silver, fancy silver, slither silver. But me personally, I would definitely rock with it like this, bro. You need fancy forward so you get the glitchy hop step animations. And uh contact finisher so you can dunk on people. So yeah, I definitely rock with contact and fancy on gold, just them two by itself. For shoot, man, you got 10 of them things. It's perfectly fine. It's, trust me, you're going to be greening like crazy, bro. Just make sure you know your jump shot, man. You're going to be straight. Quick draw, silver. Range extender, gold. Hot zone, gold. Green machine, silver. That's all you need to shoot on this game, bro. I'm telling you, that's all you need. For playmaking, man, it gets kind of... it's. I ain't gonna lie, it's, it's kind of tough because you only got 10 of them things, but you gotta rock with a quick first step and the handles for days on, what's it called, on um, Hall of Fame off rip. You need those two. I say rock with bronze unpluggable, bronze diamond. Just a little boost for your teammates so they can shoot. But, you know, when you don't play with a 50 teammate, you're gonna be straight, you feel me? Or you can rock with a bronze below. 
But I, yeah, I probably wouldn't even put Bell out on, bro, to be honest. I'll just put it on Diamond. All right, we got 18 of them things, so you are playing a big man role on this build, so you want to rock Rebound Chaser. Pogo, Gold, Rim Protector, Hall of Fame. Let's see, Intimidator. Box on Bronze. And let's see, one more. You can put that on Clemps, just in case you got to switch and guard to guard for a little bit of something, man. But yeah, I definitely rock with my bad setup probably like this. Even probably take Box out, to be honest. Put it on Clemps or put it on Pickpocket. You know, something like that or Interceptor. Something like that, you feel me? But I oh, wish they got one more. I'm tripping. We still got one more, yo. Oh, you put it on box, yeah. It don't really matter, bro. But definitely rebound chaser, rim protector, and intimidator and pogo. I probably even put pogo hall of fame to be honest, bro. I just rock with it like this. This bad setup is definitely alright. But that's all I got for y'all boys today, man. I appreciate y'all stopping by and watching the video, man. The speed boost and paint beast is definitely a dominant build, bro. Just make sure you put it to the right use, bro. You feel me, bro? This is a dominant ISO build. But if y'all enjoyed this video, man, make sure y'all drop that like, man. We aim for 25 likes on this video, man. 2,000 subs in July, bro. Let's get right, man. Giveaway coming at 2,000 subs. Y'all know the vibes, man. Make sure y'all leave some feedback. I mean, yeah, leave some feedback in that comment section, man, so I can get at all y'all boys. It's been your boy Duffy, man, and I'm out.